Welcome back to Old Country Cooks. Miss Old's behind the camera. We're going to be cooking out here on the Monument Grill. We're going to use it pretty much like an oven today instead of really grilling anything. So I've got the, Rebecca wants to come show over here on the grill. I've got the two white burners on. Everything's off, so we're going to put the food on the left side. We're, if Rebecca can come in and do a close-up on the gauge thermometer, we're we'll right at uh, 425 degrees. Both of these um, things that we're cooking is supposed to be uh, cooked at 425 degrees. I'm going to do a dessert, which is a Dutch baby. Now let's get this on the road here. And now we're going to make the dessert, the Dutch baby. You can go ahead and get you another one of these aluminum pans and with some butter in it. This is two tablespoons and you'll go ahead and sit it in your uh, grill let the butter melt and get your pan hot. Rebecca's going to do that right now. Alright, you're going to need your uh, mixer or you could do a hand blender or you can, you can do this with a whip, right? Yes. All right. Go ahead and get this released. We're going to use six large eggs. I got them right here. One cup of half and half. It just adds a richer flavor if you use cream or half and half. Turn that egg off the top. Put that down in there. All right. One cup of flour. And it has some has the salt. I put the salt in here, which I think says two pinches. Yep, two pinches of salt. And you know what? What? I think that's all the ingredients for that part, right? You know what? You're right. You're right. What are we going to top this with? We are going to top it with some macerated strawberries and blueberries and some uh, maple bourbon syrup. Maple, maple bourbon syrup, yeah. Sweet bourbon barrel aged that stuff. syrup. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. Power on. And we'll just do the, we'll do the ice cream. <laughs> done with the blending I used the ice cream mix setting on here which it pulps about four or five times and then it goes to about a one to one and a half minute uh, full blend cycle once that's done you're ready to go if you're doing it by hand just make sure everything's well incorporated we're going to go ahead and get the uh, butter pan out I'm going to hand Rebecca the, the pads we just want to make sure the butter's all evenly as much as possible over the pan it's kind of kind of Swirl this in here. If you swirl it, it puffs up prettier. Swirls left, right. All right, we're ready. This stuff goes in 425 degrees, same as the other one, for 25 to 30 minutes, however long it takes, about 25 minutes.
strawberry. Mmm. Mm. Tastes like a pancake, guys. Mmm. Last time I taste tested one of these, he couldn't quit I eating. Couldn't quit eating so. <laughs> All right, guys, a lot of flies out here. We're going to take this inside. The, the cooking times will be different on each grill, but you can still, all this, you can visually see that it's done by looking at the crust and by looking at the top of the Dutch baby. The Dutch baby won't jiggle anymore. Won't jiggle anymore, so that's all you got to do. I hope you like this. Uh, first time here, please subscribe, share, like, uh, ring that bell, get all of our notifications, thumbs up, which is that like. Comment. Uh, leave a comment. We love those, and I answer you back. And most important, you guys come, come back. back. Bye.